What are some of the rules which can make or break a great public speaker? The first rule is body language. Body language is super important. Uh, that is the definitely the highest proportion um, of information that people read from you. What you say, people only kind of listen to a tiny bit, but what you, the way you act, the way you compose yourself, um, has a far greater impact. Have you ever heard of um, uh, Amy Cuddy? Uh, she does this great TED talk on power poses. So the way you kind of sit, you compose yourself, maybe you, know, you, you use like big arm movements, like David Cameron, for example, when he's been doing his speeches, are all politicians. The big society, um, it makes a difference to how people perceive you. If you're all small and timid, people perceive you as small and timid. But if you kind of sit out, you know, back straight, looking, looking authoritative, you may not feel it yourself, but just by doing it, you're going to feel a lot stronger. What I want you to do now is look at this image. So you've got Vladimir Putin on one side and Donald Trump on the other. What does this photo say to you? What is their posture relaying? Who is in the power pose? Who is in the weaker pose? I think this is, it very much depends on you as an individual. Um, Donald Trump is doing this kind of like triangle motion and that's really quite common for politicians. Um, why? Maybe it's because triangles are the strongest shape in the universe. Um, but then in some ways, his, his legs are kind of pointing outwards. It still looks a little bit, a little bit more intimidated. Vladimir Putin, on the other hand, is doing a solid fist, um, like kind of closed arms. It means very closed off. His legs are parallel to each other, a very strong and sturdy pose. But he's also kind of leaning over a little bit, which is slightly aggressive. What I want you to take from this is think about how you conduct yourself. How do you come across? How do people view you? Always go in with a firm handshake. Always have, make sure you have a good posture. Always think about, am I being too introverted? Am I being too extroverted? Try and find the nice balance.